Hey everyone. I'm going to do something pretty different for this next series of videos. Something I've never done before. I've got a big piece of Cobden cannonball shirt, it's known as. You can see why. I'm going to try and take a big spalling flake or two off of here. But uh, we'll see how that goes. I don't, really don't have a lot of experience taking large flakes off of big pieces of chert. I've never worked Cobden before. This is pretty much all cortex here. But it's the right kind of angle. Let's see if I can take off this lump in the middle first. That worked pretty well. Got rid of a lot of that mess anyways. This looks like pretty nice stuff on the inside. Maybe I'll try and make something out of this first before I uh, mess this stuff up too badly. Get used to the material with these chunky pieces first. So I reduced one of those chunks down. Snapped it in half a couple times of course. But I really like this material. It works really nicely once you get the hang of it. Just made a little arrowhead preform there. to get used to the material then I cleaned up this area a little bit created a few small steps but that shouldn't be a problem then tried to take another big flake off this way got that but I think I also created a secondary flake that's going in here somewhere crack runs all the way into there so I'll probably just need to give this a tap maybe it'll come off maybe I messed it up pretty bad who knows we'll see this is what I used again to try and take this big flake off did a lot more than I thought it did. A lot more than I wanted it to. I held it on too much of an angle that way. Completely overshot what I wanted to do. I wanted to take this flake off. Ended up taking a whole bunch of that off. I wanted to try and make this my point, the final point by facing the end. might still be able to 
maintain this length. Got a lot of work to do to thin this down though. This might be able to turn something uh, somewhat nice out of this, but that's a really chunky, weird looking piece. It's going to be tricky to work. Maybe we'll try and turn this into something first.